Good evening YouTube, welcome back to Richmond. Special one for you tonight. You can see before you uh, a 3D printed LNER Gresley bogey. Uh, this is made by uh, Eyes and Glass Models who have kindly sent me two for evaluation and testing. Um, first inspection, they are very well printed. Um, you can just make out the print lines. Um, there is some very fine Rivet and detail there. If we just zoom in, when we get a zoom, there we go. Very well picked out. have been scrubbed and cleaned. Got some uh, brake block uh, approximations as well. However, on this one, um, one corner of the brake blocks uh, is missing. I'm assuming that's an error in print, which is not a problem. Um, there are some holes in the uh, inside of the bogies with four wheels. I'm not sure where I should be fitting bearings first. On one end of the bogey frame there is a slot. I'm assuming this is to uh, facilitate gluing a coupling on of some description. Now over here is the other one. Let's just focus on that. I fitted some Hornby wheels to it. Um, it runs quite smoothly. I think it could do with being a little bit smoother. Um, there is a little bit of play. You can see that a fair bit of play there. I'm assuming it might need bearings, so I may fit some bearings to it tomorrow and have a look. And uh, here is, in comparison, if I've got it, a uh, Ian Kirk bogey. You can see the wheelbase is pretty much the same. Height is a bit different. You've got a boss here on the top of the rising glass bogey, whereas you haven't on the uh, Kirk. And that is quite a bit higher than that one, so they may run quite well on the Ian Kirk coaches without any need to uh, file the insides of the sole bars. Put that way. And just here we have a Backman um, bogey from Thompson Coach. That's quite a good. Uh, yeah, that's still higher with the boss there. Um. This also got Hornby wheels on it, so the wheels are the same diameter and uh, the axis are the same length. These are quite free running as you'd expect from a ready to run bogey. So, we'll uh, experiment with these a bit in the coming days and uh, we'll see how we get on with them. So, watch this space.